Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and today we are playing Slender Threads, the prologue. There's only the prologue out so far. Um, so let's, let's start. Don't make your living selling other people's books when you're trying to write your own. Huh? It seems brilliant at first. Immerse yourself in your craft. Get a sense for what's popular. Gather moments of inspiration from the unassuming corners of the world. But immersing yourself in anything eventually takes its toll. Nightmare would eventually get less, I don't know, nightmarish? That's not how that works. I need to take a break. Get out of this. Oh. Uh, okay. Pen. Notepad. What? Why can't I click it? Skip tutorial! So he's an author. Can't imagine plants last long in here. Okay. Mm. Sign. What's that? I love this angle with all the, like, we're, like, on the... On like a bookcase painting. Small town hotel art at its ugliest. Oh. Books. Hasn't been the most successful sales trip so far. But hey, this town might want the whole pile. Oh. Bed. No way I'm getting back to sleep right now. Not after that. After what? Seems appropriate that I'm staying in a room as disheveled as I am. Right then, I think we're ready to leave. Uh, room four? Judging by the state of my room, I don't want to see this one. I don't think anybody wants to see it. Um, plants! Healthier than the one in my room, I'll give it that much. Ashtray. There are more cigarette butts on the floor than there are in here. Painting. I think I passed by this view on my way into town. Room two. There's a do not disturb sign on the door. Why can't I look at that? And, oh, the blood Not sure if anyone's staying in this room. Uh, okay. Healthier than the one in my room. I'll give it that much. Okay. Uh, let's ignore the stains on the ground, I suppose. Let's look at the maps. Down Town first. maps. Don't see any maps, though. <laughs> Hello. Well, if it isn't the traveling writer, you know welcome who I am? to Villa Ventana. Villa Ventana. Have we met? Oh, no. But I saw your suitcase full of books burst open on your way into the hotel. Oh. And since it sounds like you are indeed a writer, you simply must meet Oswaldo. Who's Oswaldo? Who's Oswaldo? Exactly. Oh, a most charming and riveting storyteller. The life of every party he attends. In fact, he lives just a few doors down from here. Uh, thanks, miss. I'll drop by. Do you tell strange. him Gladys says hello? How do you... That's... Okay. You look overdressed for this play. You're looking elegant. Maybe too elegant for a place like this. Oh, I know, dear. Sadly, this filthy excuse for a hotel happens to be the only one for miles. Give it a rest, Gladys. 
I'll give it a rest when you learn how to brew a halfway decent cup of tea. Is she crazy old thing? Okay. He love me. <laughs> Why is she here though? I guess where are you? Where are you visiting from? from? Oh, about five blocks, give or take. Why? You live here? Why are you staying in a hotel? Young man, vacationing is about mindset, not distance. Okay. You've traveled much farther than me to be here, but are you on vacation? No. Uh, good point. Okay. Take care. That's it. Plant. Little touches like this help distract from all the stains. Yeah, there are a lot of stains everywhere. Man. A jerk. <clears throat> Uh, hello? Mm -hmm. I know you. Harvey Green, uh, room three? Um, do you have a map of town I can borrow? Mm. I want a map. That's odd. What? People don't usually ask for maps. Huh? You're not in the book. Uh, maybe the morning guy forgot to add me when I checked in. <sighs> yeah, maybe. So, map? On the stand behind you. There's nothing Stands there. Stands empty. Well then, guess I'm out of maps. Guess so. Guess I don't Thanks. get a map. No problem. Uh, certificates. The Leonard Bacher Award for Exemplary Hospitality. Who's Leonard Bacher? I am. Now cram it. <laughs> Exemplary hospitality, my ass. Oh! Looks like keys for each room. There were not that many rooms up there. There were only eight. Why are there nine keys? Luggage. Not my bags. They're much too nice. Laundry? Locked. Ready to leave? Or is there anything else? We just came from there. Bell. No hotel front desk is complete without a bell. Uh, yeah, it looks like it's. I'm, I'm done. With it. I'm out of things to do. The evening air is perfect. I'll give the town that much. Okay. Bike. It's been here at least as long as I have. Hope it doesn't rain. Sign. Hotel. Hotel. Well, not the most creative name for a hotel. Storage. Old neglected barrels and crates. Old neglected barrels and crates. Okay. Trash. Old neglected barrels and crates. Why? Okay. Pigeon. Can I go the other way? I think that's like deeper into town. Pigeon. Railroad. Haven't heard any trains so far. I wonder if this is abandoned. Ah, oh. oh, hey there, little fella. Where are you off to? Can we run into the forest. Oh, we following him. <gasps> what the hell was that? I'm... Uh... Welcome to Villa Ventana, your window to a better life. Window? I feel like a door would be more helpful. Mm, you can jump out a window. Okay... No way. I don't know what that creature was and I don't want to find out. But I do! No way. Uh, I don't know what that creature was. Fine. I need more items. Speed. Exercise extreme caution when crossing. Why? I haven't seen a single car on the road. Huh. Why 
is there a tiny door? Coming up next on Among the Shadows. Another most foul. New radio drama. I haven't heard of this one. And what role will recent arrival Harvey Green Whoa. play in these troubling events? Wait, what? Hey, who's in there? How do you know my name? Oswaldo? This isn't funny. I'm going inside. We found Oswaldo. Hello. This looks uh, abandoned. Or worse. Wait a second. So who's listening to the worse? radio? And where is the radio? Clock. I think it's broken. The wall is covered in newspaper clippings, pictures, and scribbles. But why is there a crossword puzzle in the middle here? And what are these paper scraps stuck around it? Scissors? That'll be helpful, hopefully. Was there a struggle here? Why else would all these chairs be knocked over? Anger! Sounds like it's coming from in there. In where? Oh, it's locked. It's the desk? Why? Scissors. No, that's not what I want. That would probably just damage the lock. Okay. Did Oswaldo board up his own windows? Okay, back over here. Okay, we have to go in the bathroom. Hello, Oswaldo? The front door was open. Still Is open. everything okay? Besides the stranger in your house, I mean. It's filthy, just like everything else. Oh, Frank. Okay. Um. Okay. It's filthy, just like everything else. Who? End table. Doesn't sound like the radio's in there. Doesn't seem like anyone's in there. What would that do? Wow, okay. Hmm, no. <laughs> I don't see the point. How would that help? Scissors? I shouldn't damage this. It looks important. You should damage it. That's why. This house needs a lot more than routine housekeeping. Not sure why I'd do that. You can pick the lock! How would that help? Hang! Throw the book at that the door. That seems pointless. I fucking hate you. Um, I'm gonna leave. I think it's broken. It's broken. I don't see the point. I don't see... Yeah, uh, I hate you. Um... Oh my god! Oh, the mannequins huh. from the clothes. It's a whole mannequin. A little beat up, but it's in one Can piece. I steal it? Maybe I could clean it up and sell I it. I can't steal it! Mannequin. Alright. There's a car. Are we seriously out of space? What am I supposed to I shouldn't to do? venture too far from the hotel without a map. Okay. <sighs> There's gotta be more to this than just Is a crossword. This a Closer. Cage. Harold! Hunt. 
wanted untie. The remaining letters spell Telltale Heart. In that story, the narrator had. It's under the rug! I hope Oswaldo didn't consider that a source of inspiration. Alright. The rug. Pull it up now. There's a crease in the Do corner it. of the rug, as if it's been folded up recently. Am I really going to look yes. under there? I have to, right? Huh? Something down there is reflecting light from the window. It's, a, it's key. a key! We got the key! Let's go! There we go, that took way This longer. looks like it fits. Stop right- ah! Don't move. Good God, what the hell's going on in here? Who are you? What's your name? Uh, I'm not gonna lie. My name is Harvey Green. I'm in town for business. I'm staying over at the- What business? Uh, books? Uh, I sell books. I have a card in my pocket. Uh, can I... Slowly. What's all this on the wall? What have you been doing? I Nothing. No, I, I, I don't know what any of this is. Bullshit. It's true. I've been in here for just a few minutes. I've been in town less than a day. Whatever's on that wall, it must have taken weeks. Let's say I believe you. Why are you in here? Oh, I was I was told. A woman at the hotel suggested I meet Oswaldo. Describe her. O older, dressed like she was at the Kentucky Derby. <laughs> That's Gladys, all right. Mr. Green, do you have any knowledge of Oswaldo's current whereabouts? No, Sheriff. Then I have a missing person on my hands. Check the bathroom, you heathen. <sighs> Listen to me. I don't know what the hell's going on in this room. I do know that if people caught wind, it'd cause a town-wide panic. Why did you come in here? So you and I are gonna make a deal. I let you walk straight back to your hotel, and you tell no one about what you saw. Can I say no? Say a word or skip town, and I personally escort you to a jail cell. Do we understand each other? No. Yes, Sheriff. Good. Now get but out But I wanna here. know what the- okay. Shit, shit. Breaking into a house? What was I thinking? Am I losing it? No, I swear I heard my name coming from in there. I didn't imagine it. I, I couldn't no. have. And even if I did, I couldn't have imagined all that other stuff I saw in there. Yeah. I, I can't just sit in here and ignore Let's it. go back! For starters, <coughs> this is the only interesting thing that's happened in months. You can put this in your other- in your- in your new book. In another book. Nothing I've already looked at. Alright, let's go! Same. Everything looks the same. I'm not gonna have to do anything. Just crack on the floor. Little touches like this help distract from all the. Enjoying your stay, dear. I dropped by Oswaldo's house. Oh, lovely, dear. How is he? He is fucking He's, missing. Um. He was... out. You creative types are always off making mischief. <laughs> I saw some sort of creature at the edge of the forest. Do you have any idea what that might what have been? What if the creature is oh, where Oswald we'll see the stuff. occasional raccoon or skunk. This was bigger than a skunk. It snatched a rabbit and ran away. Why are you thinking it's a ah, creature? A bobcat like then. Rare for them to venture so a, close. Looks like okay, a person. Okay, if you say so. Alright. Take care. Okay, let's go. I wanna look I don't see anyone in there. 
Not sure why I'd do that. How would that help? Cut him! Not sure why I'd do that. Good evening, officer. Evening, mister... Oh, uh... My name's uh, uh, Hugo. Victor Hugo. Why? I'm a tourist. A tourist? Huh. We don't get many of those. Well, welcome to Villa Ventana, Mr. Hugo. Stay out of trouble and all that. W what happened in there? I'm afraid I can't comment on that, Mr. Hugo. Scene's still under investigation. As in crime scene? Well, that's what the sheriff's gonna figure out in the morning. Ugh, I probably shouldn't have said that even. Is it safe for me to be out at this hour? Are you keeping out of the crosswalk over there? Uh, yes. Then you're fine. What's so dangerous about it? I wish I knew. Almost every time we're called out, it's because some pedestrian got hit. Spice. An enormous creature jumped out at me at the edge of the woods. Ha! <laughs> First time in deer country, Mr. Hugo. This was no deer. It was brown. Like a deer. Totally silent. Like a, like deer. a deer. You don't understand. It. Relax, Mr. Hugo. You're not the first to get spooked. I promise the deer will leave you alone if you give them the same courtesy. No. Okay. All right. So... Stay safe. Get out of the road! Watch it, buddy! What the heck? The mannequin on the crosswalk. Seeing a person lying in the street would definitely get the officer's attention. Yes! But even in this light, an undressed mannequin doesn't look much like a person. Alright, we need to go to the trash can. Wait a second. This guest wouldn't mind a bit of tidying, right? I got it. There we go. If I carry any of this around, someone might ask me to clean. The housekeeper's cleaning up in there. Right, there we go. Now I can go get clothes for the mannequin. All right. I did have to go back in. Still locked. These are all still wet. Very wet. Clean and dry. Let's see. Ooh, some of these are sharp. Might help me close a sail or two while I'm here. All right. Great, now the mannequin's dressed better than I am. This should look like the real deal to that cop. Here goes nothing. Shit! Shit! That wasn't supposed... Oh, God, what if I... I... I, I know this man. Huh? From my... Did you see what happened, Mr. Hugo? I... I, I didn't. I, I heard a crash, and, um... This damn crosswalk! Sign's useless! Get back to your hotel, Mr. Hugo! I'll call an ambulance! Yes, officer. I'm not going back to the... to the hotel. <laughs> I'm gonna go in here and exploit that! If I keep it down, hopefully he won't even ring. The radio should... It's time to take a look. Alright, let's go! Hmm... There it is. Take it. And it's turned off? How? Take it. Whatever. I need to find that station. Take it. No light, no shadows, Oswaldo. 
No light, no shadows. No light, no shadows. No light, no. Coming up next. No, it's happening. I have to warn Lena. <gasps> Who's Lena? Uh, what did I just... That's what the uh, hand is. That was him. He was right in front of me. And, and that thing just took him. What did you find, Oswaldo? I'm gonna go to the bathroom now. Okay. Pretty boring assortment of magazines, especially given what's in the other room. Old, tattered, and crusty. Classic bathroom sink. Ugh. Pretty sure it's There's a map. All right, we got that. All right, we can go now. Oswaldo's diary. Hmm. There's several references to a Lena. Must be the same Lena he mentioned in that vision. Wherever she is, I have to find her. I imagine it'll be easier than finding Oswaldo. Lena wasn't at art June 3rd. Lena wasn't at art. Lena wasn't at book club, so I stopped by after. She opened the door the instant I knocked and asked if I felt the pull that brought me. What the hell does that mean? Hope she just has a fever. June 7th. The pull of what? I was concerned for Lena, so I checked on her. Why can't I stop thinking about this? I need to talk to her again. Some equations. What are these symbols? June 10th. She opened the door and asked the same question. Suddenly I realized the answer was yes. She brought me inside and told me, and told, no, I shouldn't write it down. June 13th. I can't shake the suspicion that she's right. Need to know for sure. Brought home everything the town archives would, would part with. Need to cancel plans. 15th of June. It's true. It's got to be. So many flukes. So many coincidences were caused by some force moving some force moving pieces into place. Is that same f is that same voice force causing me to discover this? How could I even tell? Hands. Seventeenth of June. Went to Lena's to share my findings, but no answer. The neighbor told me what happened. I must find a way to reach her, but carefully. I but carefully. If I'm right, even listening to the radio is a threat. I can't drop my guard for a moment. June 18th. This is a game of light and shadows. Light and shadows, he was reading that. Our actions each cast a light, each light in turn casting a shadow. Somehow those shadows can bend the light that casts them. It follows that I, I must... It follows that. I must cast no light. I'm... I'm getting too close. I must be vigilant. No light, no shadows. These look like sketches of a room. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, it's over. That was it. Did the radio cause my vision of Oswaldo? Yes. How? Guess we gotta go find Lena. Shit, that cop is oh. back. Out the window. Right, let's see. So we're here. If we can go down this road, 
You know what these two voices are. All right, let's go. Let's go down this way first. This construction sign. Wonder how long these have been coming soon. House for sale. House for sale. Open house. Open house today. Charmingly rustic cottage featuring old world charm and new world financing options. Hello? Does any house in this town have people in it? No. This ah! one does now. What the Fosco Moretti? Realtor. Licensed and accredited. Who are you? And to whom do I have the pleasure of showing this magnificent piece of real estate? Oh, ho, ho, I am not in the market for a... Oh, ho, ho. Everybody's in the market, my friend. Some of us are just standing a little closer to the register. Your name? Uh, Harvey. Well, I have to say, Mr. Harvey, seeing you here in this immaculately tiled parlor, I see a man of purpose. Am I wrong? I have a job, if that's what you mean. Not a job, Mr. Harvey. <laughs> a calling, a yearning from within. You, Mr. Harvey, you... I suppose I'm writing a... An author, my... God, I stand in the presence of a modern-day Hemingway. You know he's still alive, right? Mr. Harvey, you must agree that every great writer requires an equally great writing environment. I, uh... Where do you currently do your writing? <laughs> hotel rooms. I travel a lot for work, so mostly from hotel rooms. Hotel rooms? Oh, so drab, so utterly lacking at no. No, that won't do at all. What an artist like you needs, Mr. Harvey, is a house. But not just any house. This house. This house. <laughs> okay, listen, I'm going to stop you right there. I'm definitely not buying this house, and I definitely don't want you assuming otherwise. I understand, Mr. Harvey. Thank you. You just need a little more time to see what I see. <sighs> Which is? That you and our sleepy little town are destined for each other. And when you come to that realization, I will be here. I promise you'll be the first to know. All right then, let's go look around the house. He's following me! Oven. Ooh, oven seen better days. Works just the same. Heat is heat, after all. I don't like you. I suppose that's true. The usual kitchen equipment. I'm afraid that's locked and empty. If it's empty, why is it locked? Well, at the previous open house, a devilish little girl hid in there and promptly fell asleep. Had half the town out looking for her when she popped out looking right as rain. What can I use this wrench for? Bar. I guess the bar is a nice feature. Much more for you than for me. What do you mean? Your torso extends above it. Or as I. Yeah, <laughs> you short. No angle. Oh, crack the window. Crack. Someone left some lotions and cologne and here. The... Guilty. A realtor must look and smell his best. It's cracked. But it's cracked. That's it. Closet. Closet looks a little small. An optical illusion, Mr. Harvey, I assure you. This closet features no fewer than 200 cubic feet of space. I was almost inclined to list it as a second bedroom. <laughs> no. I'm not so sure. I don't think I could fit much in there. A skeptic? <laughs> I respect that. <laughs> Allow me then to demonstrate. Just one side of this closet can, can house a full-bodied man such as myself. Do it, do it. Get in there. I want to lock you in there. 
Locking it. I'm pretty sure I could do a cartwheel in here. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> he can open it himself. It's too short to fit across both knobs. Fuck. I don't follow. That seems pointless. Is this one? I don't follow. Uh, I want to lock him in. It's covered in the... I think I smell all right. Can I just... I'm going to just leave. Ah! Might we proceed with the rest of the tour? For now. Spend... I don't see anything in there to take. <sighs> picture frames. A bunch of picture frames with no pictures. Ready and waiting to hold and display your most cherished thing? memories. Please don't disturb the basket, Mr. Harvey. Those goods are reserved for the buyer, whoever she or he happens to be. Is that a bottle of... It's, it's, it's a... It's a Schlegelman Upright, yes. Impeccable eye, Mr. Harvey. What gave it away? The understated, perfectly joined paneling? Or the iconic front... I was just going to say it's a piano. Ah, indeed it is, Mr. Seat? Harvey. Indeed it is. Evening, sir. Evening. W what is this house? Sir, you stand at the majestic wrought iron gates of the Villa Ventana Sportsman Society. What? The what now? It's a hoity-toity hunting club. Can I take a look around the grounds? I'm doing some sightseeing. At the moment? Absolutely not. However, in a few hours' time, the estate will host a soiree that is open to the public. If you care to explore, that will be the ideal and legal time to do so. Got it. Thanks. Nothing to see beyond here. Right. Everything in there looks incredible. It's closed. Evening, friend. Care for a motor tour? Mo like a regular tour, but with a little something extra. Oh, yeah. You mean a motorcycle? Bingo! Are you sure that thing's safe? You kidding? Villa Ventana's streets are some of the safest around. You know, besides a deadly and gruesome car accident earlier this evening. What's the tour route? Right up Ventana Hill. Killer views up there, along with our observatory. And then back down, I assume? Oh, walking back down's half the fun. It's the getting up there part that needs a little extra horsepower. Fair enough, that actually works. Do you know a person named Lena? <gasps> what car Lena? accident? Hmm, maybe rings a bell. Don't think I've met her. Okay, thanks. Oh, there, there was a car accident? You didn't hear it? It was a block or so that way toward the hotel. Couldn't tell whose car it was. But I could tell they didn't make it. I thought all the talk about that crosswalk was garbage. Now I'm not so sure. I'm so sorry. All right, I'll do the tour. Great. Now, as to the small matter of payment. <laughs> I'm strapped at the moment. Any chance I could ride for free? By any chance, do you mean zero chance? Mm, no. Then no. You know where to find me. Can I steal his motorcycle? That's a handsome vehicle. Nearly as handsome as the driver. I barely trust myself on a bicycle. City Hall. Archives. 
it's just as cluttered as the shelves. A complete mess of books, binders, and historical artifacts. If this room uses an organizational system, I'm not seeing it. If this room uses an organizational system, I'm not seeing it. I wouldn't know where to start. I wouldn't know where to start. All right. Historical document. Wonder if they're replicas or the. I'm already on thin ice. Hardly the time to be spotted with a gun. It's a dusty wax statue of some old leader. The town's founder, maybe. Ugh. Sticking to my finger. I'm surprised it hasn't melted. I probably shouldn't. Jaunty. It's a badly printed replica of the original town charter. Wait, did they really put don't eat the mushrooms in their founding document? <laughs> it's locked up tight, and I don't want it anyway. An old treasure map. Maybe this town used to be a pirate refuge. If this map's in a museum, the treasure must be long gone. It's a badly printed... Wait, did... everything no restrooms for city employees only what no i don't need to use the restroom then why on earth did you come in here i'm looking for the address of credentials i beg your pardon all requests for municipal residential data require valid authentication from the requesting party. Um, I beg your pardon again? <sighs> I need proof that you're allowed to view town housing records. So, you got proof or not? Oh, I, uh, left it at home. I I'll be back. I'm sure you will. I'm in town for work and thought I'd see the sights. Uh-huh. And which site were you interested in seeing exactly? The cabinet jammed with unsorted census surveys? Uh, I don't know. The building looked big. Figured there'd be something to look at. If you're that desperate for something to do, there's a little Villa Ventana Museum one room I over. Did. Don't bother telling me the exhibits are falling apart. I already know, and I already don't care. Is this City Hall? Last I checked. When was that? When my shift started about, I don't know, a thousand years ago. Listen, I seem to have I'm not looking for anything top secret, though. No credentials, no record. Has a man named Oswaldo been here recently? Not recently enough. He's late. Late? He checked out a pile of old newspapers from the archives. I made it very clear that he had to return them within three days. Haven't seen him since. Cheap bastard probably used them for kindling. Oh, no. All right. Don't be a stranger. We'll just keep looking. Hot dog vendor. Hey there. What do you got? Hot dogs. Anything else? Things that go on hot dogs. How eclectic. I uh, think I'm all out of eclectics. Hey, is there a woman in town named Lena? Lena? Oh, sure. I don't see her too often. She's a vegetarian. Do you know where she lives? Sure don't. Someone over there in City Hall should, though. Right. Thanks. Selling a lot of hot dogs? Not yet. Waiting for folks to start stumbling out of the bar. After a few rounds, these things go straight from suspicious. 
Too delicious. <laughs> you speak the truth. Isn't it about time to wash that apron? Hell no. Gotta keep expectations low. Fair enough. If I look clean, the hot dogs look even filthier by comparison. One hot dog, please. That'll be three fifty. I'll um pay you tomorrow. Then I'll um give you a hot dog tomorrow. Anything I could take off your hands for free? Got a few expired ketchup packets. How expired are we talking, sir? That is a very sad question. Just give me the <laughs> damn packets. All right, what do I do with those? Bar. Vino Ventana. Bar. Eh, not really in the mood for a drink. A casino! Okay. So you're not in the mood for a drink, but you are in the mood for a gambling? Okay, wonderful. Cashing in or out? Cashing in. Excellent, sir. Your funds? Uh, fun? Money, sir. For your chips? Oh, right. Money. You do have money, yes? If you don't, I must... Oh, no, of course I do. It's in my other wallet. I'll be back. Am I gonna steal some money? If you aren't the one loading the dice, they're probably loaded against you. Upstairs must be reserved for the high rollers. If I had any money on me, this would be a great way to lose it. <laughs> the most worked up you'll ever see adults get over a marble. Matches. All right. Evening. Obviously. Randolph, don't be rude to the wino. He looks like he's had a rough life. What the fuck? Encouraging to see at least one person with a book. I probably shouldn't. I shouldn't interrupt him. Bookstore. Need help finding anything? My name is Harvey Green, and I'm a salesman with McGinty. I'd love to- McGinty? I don't recall their ever sending someone out this way. I believe they haven't, ma'am. I'm here to test the waters, so to speak. How are the waters so far? Lukewarm. <laughs> Not surprised. Wouldn't say the neighboring towns are known for their readers. <laughs> You'd like to sell to me, then? Oh, why not, Mr. Graham? Green. Bring your samples along tomorrow, and I'll take a look. I appreciate it, Mrs... Oh, Pamela's fine. Pamela. All right, thank you. Was there anything else? Do you do anything special to bring people in? Oh, plenty. You'll notice the sale bins, for starters. We also have a couple of accomplished authors right here in Villa Ventana. I bring them in for readings and signings and the like. Tomorrow we'll be hosting Paul Frey. Ever heard of him? Real heady type. I happen to be a bit of an author myself, and, uh... Oh, you must forgive me. It's been a long day. If you have something for me to read, could it wait until tomorrow? Oh, uh, right. Certainly. Feel free to browse. Of course these are on sale. <laughs> Never They're even 50 heard of cents. Most of them. 30 cents! Shelves. Decent selection, but a bit dated. Might actually be able to sell some books here. Tonight, local author Paul Frey reads from his latest novel. Mm. 
that's no use to me. There's plenty of reading material back in my room. Doesn't look like there's much. Sorry, pal. This whole part of town's under construction. Wow, that sounds like a pretty major development project. Tell me about it. I can't do anything with it. I don't see the point. Just light it on fire, please. It'll work. What would that do? Fire. Hmm, no. I'm having see no more. Voila. I don't see the. Hmm, no. Burn your manuscript. Not sure why. How would why that? Why can I combine things if there's nothing to combine? What would that do? Not sure why I'd do that. It's too short to fit across both knobs. Encouraging to see at least Okay, there we go. Let's go. Alright, I get everything now. Alright. Might we for now? Splend. I'm having trouble. See no I'm telling you, Mr. What in the Mr. Harvey, uh, the door appears to be jammed. <laughs> Uh-oh, it's really stuck. Not to worry. Very common with these older units. <laughs> Try sliding this into the latch, would you please? It's not working. Uh, hold tight. I'm gonna go get help. Oh, um, all right. <laughs> please do hurry, Mr. Harvey. <laughs> Spacious though it is, I fear I failed to inspect this closet for mm, bugs and such. <laughs> It's his fault. Hee 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 hee. Upstairs. No, the realtor. No, the realtor will hear me clomping around. Alright. 
I'm not much for cigars, but a cigar cutter might come in. Just elaborate. <coughs> Your pointing days are at an end, I'm afraid. Back. Looks like a decent select. I'll refrain from. How would that help? I'll just cut my photo off the back cover. I, I've stuck the wax. I'll consider it a minor miracle if this fools anyone. All right. To City Hall we go. Welcome back. Found a hand it open. Was that really so hard? Now what was it that you even need? The address of a woman named Lena. Last name? Um, not sure. The telegram with the requisition was smudged. Ah, <sighs> typical. Just a moment. Ah, oh, it's always something with these guys. Where the hell was that binder? Lucky for you, there's only one Lena in our records. You have a map? There you go. And hey, what a coincidence, it's finally quitting time. Wait, uh, which side of the street is... Never mind. Oh, I should have held on to that umbrella. I better hurry. This has to be the place. Okay. Seems you obvious now that I'm here. I don't see anyone around, including the sheriff. Time to get some answers. Hello? Lena? No one's here, as usual. I mean, I thought we had established she was already dead. A radio! Better. Another radio? Could it show me what happened in here? Only one way to f now, where? Do it. Well, that seems to be the entire game so far, of course. I will be definitely playing the game when it comes out, but it hasn't come out yet. Ah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have links in the description. There are videos on screen now. If you like the content that I make, you can subscribe. That would be nice. And if you like this video and you're in this far, why not drop a like on the video? It'd be great. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!